Hey, what's up guys? This is the infamous Four Ninja Toads, and we are talking about today the latest episode of Naruto Shippuden, which was uh, Na Naruto's Wedding Part 1 and 2, I believe. Alright, but uh, first of all, I want to give you guys some news. Uh, pop figures are already available. Uh, there are, okay, so there are two exclusive Two exclusive figures, which is the Naruto Sage Mode and the Naruto Six Paths. The Sage Mode will be out tomorrow at GameStop. It's a GameStop exclusive. The Six Path is a Hot Topic exclusive. So who knows when they're gonna actually put them out? I went out to I went to Hot Topic today. They didn't have any on the shelves, so I was like, okay. Uh, but they did have the other ones. They didn't have the Hot Topic exclusive one. Uh, let me see if you guys can see that. Okay, so I actually... I ordered the Six Path on the website, on the Hot Topic website, just in case, just in case I didn't, well, wasn't able to go in and get it, uh, or I missed it, or whatever. So I, that is actually on the way right now. If you guys want to order, head over to hottopic.com, and you can order it there. The Naruto Sage Mode might still be available on the GameStop website as well. If if you guys are having trouble finding it locally, try the website. Um, I, I, I don't see them uh having uh low quantities though i don't know the, the the dude said i went actually went today to gamestop they would not give it to me but they did have eight of the sage mode apparently so they have a good number of those and they, they, these are really cool figures there's also a naruto rasengan version uh which is 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 pretty cool it's not your basic just standing figure. He actually has a uh, Rasengan in his hand, which is really awesome. And the Sage, the Six Paths one is is also has that weird uh, Rasengan thing. All right. <clears throat> so if you haven't heard, also the Boruto Naruto the movie uh, is already available for pre-order. I will put a link down in the description. So please make sure you check that out. Use the link. That helps my. It helps me. Uh, uh, make some uh, commissions off of that from Amazon, and um, all right. So if if you or if you buy that, it's uh, twenty two forty nine for the Blu Ray, and this this is U, this is U S dollars, and nineteen ninety eight for the DVD, and it's available March twenty eighth two thousand seventeen, and next up after that, I believe we have. Uh, Naruto Sasuke Story Sunrise is March seventh and uh boruto volume one naruto next generations is april 4th for volume one and they already have a pre-order for volume two uh so if if you're into that uh they are available for pre-order and it's very soon march april uh and i think that's about it that we have at the moment all right, so so there goes the Naruto news. All right, so let's talk about uh, Naruto's wedding. This is part one and part two. It was a one hour. I think it was a one hour special. I just saw, I played one and it was like, oh, there's another one to watch. I was like, cool, that's so awesome. And I'm pretty sure I was caught up. So it was a, a an hour uh, special, I guess, two episodes. Uh, we had uh, part one and part two, but basically through the whole thing, it's it's kind of. I thought overall, let, make sure you guys let me know what you guys thought about it. But uh, in in the comments, this is what I thought about it. I thought it was I thought it was really funny. I thought it was uh, a, it put me in a great mood, just watching and having fun and and just laughing. Even though none of it made any sense, it was just crazy, crazy nonsense. Uh, <clears throat> but I thought it was fun, uh, to say the least. The uh, one question I did have: Who was the the little kid that was recording? the um the messages to uh naruto and hinata i have no idea who he is or 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 what was going on there i have no idea uh you guys might know uh i, I don't always pay attention too close to names and things like that so sometimes i'm i'm uh, I, i'm kind of left in the dark about some things but uh, maybe you guys know who he is he looked kind of like naruto but he had black hair uh it was kind of weird and he's 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 getting messages from everybody uh, to record, and then he goes and he edits it. Uh, he was gonna go edit it, and uh, we kind of follow Iruka Sensei a little bit. 
uh, and he, and one of his students. Uh, I thought that was pretty cool. Iruka, you know, he gave you a bit a bit of those feels uh, with his 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 little bit of a story there. And then uh, most of the time we're following around Rock Lee, and um, and <laughs> eventually he seeks the help of Might Guy. And it was just insane. And and then you had this weird little cameo of Orochimaru just kind of like saying stupid idiots or idiot. I think it was just idiots. He would say idiots, idiots. And then Yamato would come hiding behind him. Like if you notice that, that was that was pretty funny. I thought it was hilarious. But uh, <laughs> it was just so weird. It was just so funny. And uh, Yamato's trying to, I guess he's, he's watching uh, Orochimaru. And uh, I, I think, I think this is based on the book. So I don't know what exactly is if it's exactly like the book. I know there's a hidden stories, but I haven't seen it for for um, pre-order. It was Naruto hidden stories story or something like that. Huh. I know there was a book called that. I'm probably mistaken but see i haven't seen it for english i haven't seen it in english and i know i saw a japanese cover of it but i can't I, I think it's called hidden story or something like that but i'm wondering how close this is to the book it was just insane i thought it was i thought it was hilarious but uh of course a lot of people may not think so but i thought it was great let me know in the comments what you thought about the episode um I can't wait to see the next one. So, so the, the the premise is that Kakashi is gonna decide who gets to go to the wedding and who has to, you know, do their typical job of guarding the place, right? So everybody's out trying to think, thinking of gifts and oh, there's also a Neji appearance as a ghost. If you haven't seen if if you haven't seen the episode, make sure you go check it out. But there's it's it's just hilarious. It's Rock Lee and Rock Lee is just he's stressing out about it uh, and he has this dream of neji uh and he he tells him some something that just doesn't make sense strength over endurance um and in the end i think he figures out oh i'm gonna give uh, naruto some dumbbells for for as wedding presents i i don't know what the hell was going on but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed the episode um let me know what you guys thought in the comments below and if you enjoyed my video make sure you thumbs up share it you know just leave me a comment say hi say hello uh whatever but uh make sure you pick these these guys up these are really cool and and i know a lot of times like anime stuff like this doesn't sell well in the u.s a lot of times i've noticed that like uh I don't know. I don't know what it is. They're like games and stuff, they don't sell too well. So if you go, guys, go buy, go and buy the stuff. You know they'll make more of it. And uh, um, that's that's. Uh, so that's it for now, guys. This is Four Ninja Toads, and I'm out. I'm out. Peace. Yay.